What's up everyone, General Discharge here. If this is your first time with us, our voices are disguised so we can give you information on just about anything without being detected. Today's video is going to be discussing the United States Coast Guard's snipers. Yes, you heard that correctly. The Coast Guard has snipers. And in fact, they actually beat the Marine Scout snipers in the International Sniper Competition in 2018. So we guess you could argue that they, uh, they're better than Marine snipers. But we'll leave that up to you to decide. We're going to go over where Coast Guard snipers are embedded in, what they do, their training, and much more. If you're interested in learning about how the Coast Guard is cooler than you think, watch this video until the end. Before we jump into it, make sure to take a moment and show us some love and support by liking our video and subscribing to our channel. Your support is our lifeblood. Do not hesitate to ask us questions in the comments section below. We check everything. Coast Guard snipers are actually referred to as Precision Marksmen, or PM for short. They are some of the best trained snipers in the US military, often put in situations that snipers from other branches aren't put in. For example, a common scenario that a Coast Guard sniper can be put in is shooting at a moving vessel off of a helicopter. Think about that. The sniper is in a moving helicopter shooting at another moving target hundreds of yards away. That takes a certain type of skill that you just don't see in other sniper operations where they're in one position firing upon a non-moving target. The situation we just described to you is a common instance of HITRON, which stands for Helicopter Interdiction Tactical Squadron. HITRON specializes in airborne use of force and drug interdiction missions, and at times deploys snipers to shoot out the engines of the go-fast boats. Coast Guard snipers can also be found in the DSF, which stands for Deployable Specialized Forces, but more specifically in the MSRT, which stands for Maritime Security Response Teams. New drinking game. Take a shot every time we give you an acronym. Hey there, we hope that you're enjoying the video so far. General Discharge has a Patreon. If you'd like to help support the channel, please consider joining the team. Link's in the description. Now back to the video. MSRT is the only unit within the United States Coast Guard that has counter-terrorism capabilities. We cover the DSF and some of the MSRT in our Coast Guard Special Operations video, so make sure to go check that video out after you're done watching this one. The link is in the description. So, how are Coast Guard snipers trained? Well. They have been known to attend other service branches sniper schools, such as the U.S. Army Sniper School, and they also have their own organic PM course. Known as PMC, or Precision Marksman Corps, this course is 20 academic days and provides students with core precision rifle marksmanship skills. Get ready for the lowdown on what they learn here, as it is quite a bit. Students learn the operation and maintenance of a precision weapon system, ballistic science, mental performance skills, zeroing, data collection, precision rifle optics, environmental effects, range estimation, offset holds, unconventional position shooting, target engagement under stress, and much more. Yeah, that's a lot, and especially a lot to cover in just 20 days. Students are placed in shooter spotter pairs and must achieve a go in the go no go grading criteria on both roles. So how can you become a Coast Guard sniper? Well, you have to have the rating of ME, which stands for Maritime Enforcement Specialist, and then find yourself in the DSF or hit and run. As per the Coast Guard, Maritime Enforcement Specialists are a cadre of professionals well-grounded in knowledge and skills pertaining to law enforcement and security duties. As such, members of this rating can be expected to be assigned challenging duties including traditional maritime law enforcement, anti-terrorism, force protection, port security and safety, as well as providing unit-level training in these fields. This rating has quite the versatility in what they can do in the Coast Guard, so just remember that there is no guarantee you are to become a sniper in the Coast Guard just because you manage to land that rate. At the beginning of the video, we mentioned that the Coast Guard beat the US Marine Scout snipers in a sniper competition back in 2018. Well, if you want to know more about the Marine Scout snipers, it's your lucky day. We did a video on that. Oh, and we also did a video on the U.S. Army Snipers. The links are all in the description. Well, that is the down and dirty of the U.S. Coast Guard Snipers. If you learned something from this video, make sure to give us a like and subscribe to our channel. As always, thank you for watching. Do you even want to be here? A big shout out to all of our patrons over at our Patreon. Thank you all so much for taking the extra step in supporting our channel. It is much appreciated. If you'd like to be featured on a general discharge video, 
go give our Patreon a look and join the team. Here's Nick Nausea. All your friends are subscribing to General Discharge and you don't even want to be here.